Hey guys, it's Tyler here at World of Tech. Today's episode, we're going to be teaching you how to install the AWN docking station, which you can either place at the bottom, the right, or left, or top, if whichever you prefer. We're going to show you how to put it at the bottom, but you can play with the settings. It's very easy to set it anywhere else you'd like to. Um, the reasonings of putting a dock would be just to lift up your desktop wall I guess but um, I think after I get done doing this video I may switch back and add this back there so I don't know it's pretty cool so here we go and also if anybody wants this awesome wallpaper with the skulls with the Ubuntu logo right there just make sure you tell me and I'll provide you a download link there so let's get on with the show now as you can tell at the bottom I've already got rid of all the stuff there um, it, basically you just two clicks and it's gone so let's go ahead and remove this. The first thing you need to do is right click and when then of course to delete this panel, click delete and now it's gone. Now, I've already installed AWN Manager, so I'm just going to go ahead and show you real quick where you go. First you need to open up the Ubuntu Software Center. After you open that, let's type in AWN. And after that, you will see there is two. Actually, you'll see the docky station too, but the dock's the same as the AWN, and I just prefer AWN over the docky. I think it's a lot cleaner. Um, but basically, all you really need to install, though, is this one right there. By installing that one, it will automatically install this one as well. It's just like the comp is. Once that's installed, that's installed. And I believe if you install this one before this, it would automatically do the same. So once that's installed, we will close out of this. We're going to go to Applications, Accessories, and go to the AWN Manager. And as you can see, there it is. I've already set up mine to do the effects like this. Um, so we're going to go ahead and play with this uh, effects. Um, you can either right click and go to Dock Preferences, or you can go to System. You can go to um, uh, Preferences and go to AWN Settings, whichever. It's all the same. Um, basically, Preference, here we are. Um, the size of the pics uh, of the icons are default at 48, but if you want them smaller, you could do 20, but that's hard to see. So I just leave it at 48. Um, you can, of course, do the bottom, do the top, you can do the right, you can do the left, whichever. I prefer bottom. I just, it's me. And then, of course, there's different styles. You can have no style. Um, you know, of course, you can do a flat a 3D a curved one which is what I had for a little bit but I'm not too big on it um, or you can do edgy or floaty where you kind of floats there um, I like the 3D better um, of course I have it set to do panel mode basically what this means is on panel mode if I open up say Firefox that my bar down here doesn't go over this so, I mean, if I was to change that setting there, and I did always visible, then that's always visible. Or if you have one window open, it'll hide it. Um, I don't know. I like panel mode, though. It's kind of better. But like I said, I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not uh, by default. Um, and, of course, I have it start. So every time I start Ubuntu up, if I have to do updates, it'll automatically start. Um, and then, of course, I expand the panel. If not, it's going to be like this. But I like it. I mean, you might as well expand it. You're going to use it. Um, next, is, next is some uh, task managers. I don't really play with that. Applets is what I'm uh, all about. They have cool little applets. You can bring down here. And it just shows different things. And my CPU, 14, 13. Eh, I don't want that, though. You can do battery, a bandwidth monitor, uh, CPU, frequent monitor. You can have an expander so it splits it. You can have your garbage canned, which is what we did have. Um, hardware sensors, some other little nifty things. Uh, I had weather down there. You can have a little it's from the weather channel. And you'll have to, of course, set it up by default. It's uh, Amsterdam, Netherlands. So you just right click that, go to preference. And then we're just going to go and type in where we're at. And by default, it should automatically show us. And we're going to do a regular 
and we're gonna do a regular one. So close that, and there you see it's the forecast. It's pretty nifty. There's a lot of things you can do. You can only search for more applets if you'd like. Um, and then of course in our next video we will show you how to remove this and put the regular bar back and how to get all your things that you had originally back on there. Till then, this is Tyler from World of Tech and as we always say, get plugged in.